Stakeholders usually ask project managers the following famous questions, how is the project going? Or how is the performance of the project? One traditional technique often used by project managers is to compare the plan and the actual cost curves to answer. If the actual cost is less than the plan cost, can we say that the project's cost performance is well? Or are we ahead of schedule, the plan and the actual curve comparison is not enough to understand how the project is going? What is Earned Value Analysis? Earned Value Analysis is a method that allows the project manager to measure the amount of work actually performed on a project beyond the basic review of cost and schedule reports. Basic Elements of EVM Planned value is the budgeted cost for the work scheduled or budgeted cost of work scheduled. Actual costs, the actual cost for the work accomplished or actual cost of work performed. Earned value is the percent of the total budget actually completed at a point in a given time. It is also known as the budgeted cost of work performed. For example, if the total scope of work is to install 1,000 transmission towers and 600 of them are installed, the progress of the work is 60% complete. If the total budgeted cost of this work is $3 million, the EV is $3 million multiplied by 0.6 equals to $1.8 million. Earned value calculations. EV calculation formulas are Cost variance, CV equals to EV minus AC. Cost Performance Index, CPI equals EV divide by AC. Schedule Variance, SV equals to EV minus PV. Schedule Performance Index, SPI equals to EV divide by PV. If Cost Performance Index is less than 1 and a negative CV means that the project cost performance is below the plan. If the Schedule Performance Index is greater than 1 and a positive SV means that you completed more work than planned. Earned Value Management Example Let's assume a 12-month railway project that is planned to spend $3 million per month for a total budget at completion of $36 million. The project is two months along and according to the planned versus actual cost figures is underspent by 50%. We could assume therefore that the project is going well because it's costing less than planned. But after two months of work, 10% of work has been completed, so EV is 10% of the total $36 million budget, which is $3.6 million. Budget at completion, $36 million. Planned value for two months, $6 million. EV, $3.6 million. Actual cost, $3 million. Schedule variance, earned value minus planned value equals to $3.6, minus $6, equals to minus $2.4 behind the schedule. Cost variance, earned value minus actual cost equals to $600,000 under budget. Cost Performance Index, Earned Value Divide by Actual Cost equals to 1.2. Schedule Performance Index, Earned Value Divide by Planned Value equals to 0.6. Estimate at Completion, Budget at Completion Divide by Cost Performance Index equals to $30 million. Estimate to Completion, Budget at Completion minus Earned Value, Divide by Cost Performance Index equals to $27 million. Time to complete, budget at completion minus EV, divide by schedule performance index, equals to 54 months. By taking into consideration this performance, this railway project will be completed in 54 months with a $36 million budget. Earned value is a powerful technique that provides project information with the help of project schedule, planned value, actual value, and earned value calculations. It is widely used by stakeholders to understand the real performance of the project. Earned Value Management provides an early warning system for the project teams regarding the issues affecting the budget and schedule.